My name is John Pistorino, and our company, Pistorino & Allen Consulting Engineers, uh, have been involved with the building codes since the 1970s and a special consultant uh, for FEMA with respect to hurricanes. I'm the um, owner of the home in the Keys called the Sandcastle, which sits 50 feet from the Atlantic Ocean. We decided to build this demonstration building in the most vulnerable area. It was uh, constructed at the site of the uh, 1935 hurricane, which is the strongest hurricane that ever hit the uh, United States. We knew that uh, a heavy storm surge, which is problematic, as well as the winds, could damage a house. We researched uh, lighthouses that have been uh, out near this house. It was Colonel Meade of the Union Army designed it. Storm surge would flood and go around the supports of the lighthouse rather than a traditional lighthouse that you might see on the coast. This house has been designed to mimic the um, lighthouses that are around the state of Florida with very large round columns that go all the way down to bedrock. The idea is that uh, if a storm surge comes, it could wipe out, say, the uh, first level of the house, and the house would not be touched structurally. Now, the house has been constructed and up for 30 years. It's an extremely vulnerable position as far as a hostile environment is concerned. And normally, a house like this would have to be painted and protected every five years. It's very important to keep the uh, envelope of the house protected from water intrusion, and especially water, which is salt ions in it. We did jump at the opportunity to use Never Fade with Kynar, which can be applied now on various surfaces, including the masonry surfaces, the stucco, the metal surfaces, including the windows, doors, and the metal shutters. So we're very happy. We don't have to repaint the house every five years. We look forward to the house being shown with the Never Fade finish 